Welcome to a special broadcast of GMTV for Wednesday, August 16th, 2023. Seventh grade orientation. And now please welcome our GTMS administrators. Good morning, GTMS. Hello, here we are. I am so excited. Back on the TV. Back on the TV like we never left. No, nope, no. Nope. Oh my goodness. I'm Mrs. Junker. I'm the principal here at GTMS. Um, and I'm the assistant principal, Ryan Dallin, for seventh grade. So everyone that's here today, I will be your assistant principal throughout this school year and next school year yeah. as well. Thanks for joining us today. Um, a little bit about me. Okay. I'd share a little about me. Yes. I started here as a special education teacher in 2002. So I'm actually going into my 21st year here at GTMS. Wow. That's how much I love middle school. You've been here at the same school. And all those seventh graders, all of you guys are going to learn how much I love this school. Yes, yes, yes right, right off the bat, yes. <laughs> um, Mr. Down, I've been here now. This is I'm going into my fourth year here at GTMS. I love being here every day. It's a new experience. Uh, great teachers and all yeah. teams. Love it all. Uh, students are very nice and welcoming as well, are here ready to learn day in and day out. And we're here to give them a good experience as well through their middle school years. Our goal today is just to give you a little bit of history mm -hmm. and a little bit of information about GTMS. Some of you, you guys have come back. You've had more kids. Right. This so might I saw be your a lot of familiar third. faces. Yes. So you may have heard this before. Um, but hold tight, and we're going to get this information out to you all. Right. Okay? Yeah. So the building um, was opened in 2000, and you will notice today that it looks as beautiful as it did in 2000. And that really is due to our phenomenal staff, custodial staff, maintenance staff, mm -hmm. um, those departments, as well as our teachers and our students. Our students yes. are very respectful here, and they do do a great job of helping us keep it nice here, okay? Um, seventh and eighth grade, we have about 699 students. Mr. Dell and I have been going back and forth all week because our <laughs> numbers keep fluctuating, but today, this morning, officially 699. Official, we, yes. Like that number. Um, we are the home of the Grizzlies, where we respect the paw. Going to hear a lot about respect mm -hmm. the Paul around here, right, Mr. Dillon? All day, every day. Mm -hmm. B basically, that is our motto, and it really means um, how we kind of live. Students respecting them, learning how to respect themselves, respect others, respect their staff, right. and the community. So um, we do talk about that a lot. And the school colors, Mr. Down, I always like to challenge you on that one. I know. I always say blue and black, but nice. I've learned over the years it is really royal blue and black. Yes, royal blue and black. So when you're doing your school shopping, make sure you grab some of those colors for our spirit days. That's right. We have a lot of spirit days throughout yes, the year. Do. Talk about the, the teams there, Mr. So we have, on the seventh grade side, we have teams A, B, C, and D, and they all come with a character trait mm -hmm. in which each team focuses on. So if you're on team A this year, that's for accountable. Team B is be respectful. Team C is cooperative. Team D is determined. And you haven't missed anything yet, okay? You are going to learn your teams next week. Um, the parent portal will open on August 23rd. So I believe that is next Wednesday. The parent portal will open, um, and after families complete their um, registration, kind of a couple mm -hmm. little things that you have to consent to, um, then you will be able to see your courses as well as what team you are on. Right. Okay. So we do have our universal breakfast program. All this means is that all GTMS students, you have access to free breakfast in the morning every day. We have carts uh, placed in each corner of the team hallways as well as our main hallways also for those students that are uh, being dropped off in the morning. So please grab some food on the way in, get ready for your school day, have a nice full stomach, and that will help you out as well when you're going through all your classes. So again, Breakfast is free yeah. for all of our students. And even if you don't think you like to eat breakfast, I know my daughter isn't a big mm. breakfast person, get the free breakfast, put it in your book bag, your locker, and save it for after school. Good idea. because Especially if right. you do after school activities or are part of any of our athletic programs. Mm -hmm. And I hope all of you get involved in one of those things. Okay? Um, all of our teams are balanced. 
which means that all students on every team have access to all of our courses. So you'll see a list of courses here and things that are available within our school and our district. Um, one thing that we do here, we do have the second step program, which I'll, most of you, um, if you've been here in Galloway schools, know what that program is. We just take it to that next level, really focusing on proper and positive social skills, anti-bullying, and um, we have a lot of awesome assemblies. Yes, we have assemblies that go yes. along with them once a month. Yep, so you will have a lot of experiences there. All right, in a and program you'll see, we have art, computer science, engineering, design, which everyone loves, music, theater, arts, awesome, Spanish, and band. So one awesome thing here is that even if you do not have one of these things in seventh grade, you will get that in eighth grade. We specialize in scheduling around here. Yes, we do. I would say that is a is um, a skill of ours yes. so we do make sure that all of our seventh grade students and eighth grade students experience every single one of our a and h programs mm -hmm. okay that's very important to us here all right when it comes to your phys ed classes you have the option students of using the locker rooms to change so it's up to you um, the pe staff will give you a locker if you'd like to get changed every day or if you just want to come in and wear whatever clothes you're wearing for that school day, that's also fine. The PE staff just asks that you are wearing the appropriate type of shoes, sneakers. Uh, make sure you're in comfortable clothing and really be engaged in the games and activities during your PE classes. So we do have our agenda book. Each student will get one at the beginning of the school year and it serves as for multi-functions it'll serve most of our teachers use them for your hall passes so if you want to go to the bathroom go see guidance counselor and you go down to the main office they'll use it for a hall pass it also has the procedures in there of our code of conduct our support services the calendar for the year um, it can be used as an organizer. There are dates in there that you can write down what your homework is or what projects you have due. There is a place to organize uh, your school assignments in there. If you do lose one, that's all right. You need another one. It does cost $5 to replace that. Now we're getting into some uh, Respect the Paul stuff. Which is amazing. We love to recognize our students here at GTMS, and there's a lot of different ways that we do that. Here are just a few ways that we um, recognize our students. We have Student of the Month, Role Model of the Month. We have Team Incentives. So each, I don't know, every month students can they, earn right. different things, maybe every, every five days, which is amazing. Mm -hmm. um, we have big school-wide incentives, school-wide football games, basketball games, respect the bus. We really encourage our students to be positive not only in school but on our bus so you can earn incentives that way right. as well. Of course, our AB Honor Roll, our Grizzly Attendance Recognition Programs. I know this is your favorite. This is one of my one, one, one of your favorites. I have a lot favorite. of favorites here at GTMS. This is one of your Remember, favorites. it's been almost yes. 21 years yes, of I'm favorites. Sorry. But we love to read at GTMS. And a few years ago, I was fortunate enough to um, get a book vending machine. It's awesome. And it's exactly like getting a bag of Cheetos. Mm hmm. All right. Or what are those um, things? Takis. Takis. It's just yeah, like getting Takis out of the vending machine. I don't want to see them. So um, every month we do a drawing for our students, and every month we give away free books. Mm -hmm. It's awesome. It's a great way. Good reads in there. Awesome reads. And going on more with respect to Paul, so again, we're going to be talking about this throughout the school year as well. So students, make sure you make GTMS, GTMS a place where you want to be day in and day out. Do the right thing even when no one's watching because so you know what that's the time when you're going to get recognized mm -hmm. that's when you know a teacher might come up and say you know what you did a really positive thing right there and they'll give you some compliments and praise for that uh, you will be rewarded for your hard work and commitment as miss junker went through we do have incentives throughout each month uh, for marking periods as well and you will be uh, recognized due to individually or as a group as well so respect the paul again it's a big part of us here at gtms we really encourage our students to get involved. We are very lucky here at, in Galloway Schools. We um, have a Board of Education that supports our clubs and activities, and we have so many that we have to offer. So there's something almost for everybody. So take a look at this list. In your folders, if you open up your folder, you will see a small pamphlet. In the pamphlet on the back, there's a QR code. You can go on and learn more 
about each one of these clubs, okay, just to find out if it is something that you want to do mm -hmm. or be involved in. Um, throughout the year, GMTV that you are watching right now, um, students come on and they share information. They share the news of the day, right. okay? And that's where you will learn when these clubs are going to be offered and who the um, advisors right. are. And then if you like to participate in our sports, we have um, sports throughout the different seasons. So as you can see, there's cross country, soccer, field hockey, basketball, wrestling, volleyball, track and field, softball, and baseball. So we do offer a variety of sports here at GTMS. But the but key is... You need a physical. You need a physical. All the students out there, listen, listen, listen carefully. You need a physical. All right, so you can get a physical from our doctor on these particular dates. One date already passed, but you still have three available. There are going to be packets as you do your tour today, so you can pick one up if you would like, okay? Um, or you can go to your own doctor. You are more than welcome to go to your own doctor, um, have the physical completed, but it still needs to be brought to school mm -hmm. and seen by our doctor. So you still need our school doctor to approve your doctor's physical. So please make sure that you get a packet, even if you're going to go to your own doctor, and you look at those dates when you need to get that in. All right? They're good for a full year. So you, if you get it now, you're good until next August, but then you'll have to do another one for eighth grade year. Okay? So some key things here to take away to be successful here at our middle school come to school and be prepared think about what you need the night before kind of organize it so when you come it's a nice transition in the morning get enough sleep look i know you guys like to watch you know your videos or be up late at night but get enough sleep here eight to ten hours eat your breakfast we talked about that before get involved join a club a sports activity um, you'll be surprised you might find something out there that you really enjoy and use your resources. Talk with your teachers, your counselors, administrators, peers, or your own parents if you have questions and need some help. And again, it always comes back to respect the ball. Respect yourself, others, the community, and the school because kindness does go a long way. So on course, this is our uh, main system that we use to keep track of your child's grades throughout the school year. Make sure you go on our website to make sure that you have access to on course so you can keep track as the grades are updated. So you can look at uh, students' current attendance, how they're doing on their assessment, and the report cards are also distributed through on course as well. All right, we talked about students get involved, but I would love parents. to see our families get involved too. So we do have an FSA here at GTMS. You can see the information there. They will be here at back to school night, okay? So at back to school night, they will be here to provide some more information about them and what they do here at GTMS. I'm actually meeting with them um, Friday morning. Mark. So we're gonna start planning some things. Back to school night, mark those calendars, September 20th, all right? More information will be sent out to you um, via email as well as posted on our social media. But please mark down September 20th. All right, we will start at 6 o'clock. Right. So if you want to come in a little early, that's a good idea. And stay informed. All right, um, you can follow me on DTMS PG, PJ. PJ. I don't even know my last name, Mr. Dallin. That's okay. Oh my goodness, it's the first day. Um, dot check in. You can also follow our GTMS website and the school district's um, website. They are keeping a lot of information up. Yep. Most of you may already have opted into the text messaging, but if you have not, what it is, when I send out an email from the school, I add in a message, and I, my message usually says something like, um, GTMS families, check your email, or an email coming regarding back to school night. Um, so sometimes it's easy. I know my personal email is a mess of I enjoy it. different, I don't know, spams. Mm -hmm. So that text message helps me find what I need to, to look for. Right. So if you want to opt in, text Y to 67587. And then when I send out information from GTMS, you will get a message to remind you to check your email. Raffle time. Woo! So 
Those of you that did bring in canned foods or Thank dry you. foods, Thank, Thank you, you so much. Awesome. Um, these are going to be donated over to the Beacon Church, and then that will be displaced out into our community uh, when they are ready. So we have a couple different prizes out here today. What do you got, Mr. Dallin? I have a swag bag here. Swag bag? Let me see. We got Let me a little see if this GTMS. is acceptable. Okay. And we like got it. some school supplies like in there, it. too. Nice. This is great for PE. PE, yes. Right? Agreed. You can put your sneakers in here, your shirt and stuff, Change and then clothes. just kind of throw that in the locker. And that's so your PE bag. That's nice. Yeah. Okay. What else All right. got? Five below gift cards. All right. All right. That way, if you need school supplies, five below. So how many people are we pulling? We're going to pull two for five below. We're going to pull three. Okay. For the bags. If I mix them up. Mix them up. And then we got one. Yeah. And, and this much energy is what we have at... 7 30 in the morning yes on gmtv yes right yeah you, oh, and bring. you guys can actually watch gmtv each morning because mr convert does a great job of recording us and then posting it on our um youtube, YouTube channel yep. so you can actually parents and families watch us so you know what the kids are getting each day so when right, they come over yeah. and say nothing happened today yeah. check out gmtv check out gmtv something happened today it's a middle school <laughs> yes all right first one up for the bag Number five three five zero three one zero five three five zero three one zero. Congratulations! Congrats! All right, five below gift card for five three five zero three zero eight five three five zero three zero eight. We'll have these. When you come around, yes. so if you forget the number, that's fine. Hopefully, and, there's some winners out there. Already. Yes, I hope so. Another bag here, five three five zero three zero one five three five zero three zero one. Another for the five dollar five below gift card, five three five zero three zero two five three five zero three zero two. Can pick the last one. Yeah, let's do the ice cream place. Lily <gasps> Hopper? I always... I, Lindy I get, Hops. Lindy Hops. I, sorry, four years. I still don't know every restaurant. Oh, and goodness. I don't know. It's ice cream. It's ice cream. ice cream. Right. For a small gelati. Oh. Gelato. Gelati. Whatever you want to call it. All right. <laughs> and that is for ticket 535-0307. 535-0307. So there's, still, there's still more in here. You know what? You more? know I have to. You know right. what I have to do? Do it. I have to give away a book. Give away a book. Let's I have to do give it. Because look, you I got the coins. Some, I, I snuck some Where'd coins in my from? pocket. Where they my come pocket. from? All right. So um, this one's going to be for the book vending machine. So I have to give away a book. It's school. Right. I mean, the seventh graders might not want the book, but the parent with them will be happy. Yes. <laughs> All right. Three five five three five zero three zero oh, three. Whoever three zero oh, three is. 303, right. you're going to get the token. You guys token. are going to find us when you come around after your tour. We'll be in the comments, and we will be able to hand all this stuff to you. Remember, be the best that you can be. All right. Always respect the poll, and our teachers are going to now give you a little presentation as well in the classroom. So, How do we sign off again? Well, okay, everyone has a great day. Everyone have a great day. And respect, respect the, the poll. Grr. Grr.